gets worse. That's when you'll see bolts, you know. We're in New Dorp on Staten Island, New York, and we're from Troop 4, uh, Boy Scouts, and we're cleaning up houses and feeding people who are affected by Hurricane Sandy. Um, we've been, this is the second time we've, we've been here, and uh, we started since about 8 in the morning. It's now 2.07, and uh, we're just going to tell you a little bit about how we, how we were affected as well. When I heard about this, I was it was from the television uh, of like we had Hurricane Irene last year, so we knew what to do. So since I live in the woods, there's a lot of trees around me, and we got a lake up the block, so we had to put sandbags in front of my house so we could prevent a flood and tape up the window so if anything knocks into it, it would it would break but stay intact. This is the first time we've had a hurricane of this proportion here. We have 24,000 homes that have been affected by this uh, tragedy. We're on the other side of the island. We came down last weekend and we fed the volunteers as well as the homeowners. We uh, served up about 150 hamburgers, 150 hot dogs, and uh, soup. So we figured we'd come back this week and do the same thing. So the hurricane left a devastating amount of damage. People had no power, boats were in the middle of the street, and trees were down, and we had to do. We had to bring everybody together. We had to make things right. We had to bring everybody. After the hurricane, we once all of our friends and families and uh, loved ones were safe. We tried to reach out to others and help rebuild their homes, give them food, give water, and just to do whatever they need for help. We knew that once we were safe, we needed to reach out and help the people that were in need because it's our duty as scouts to go out and help these people. We need to look out for the people that we know because we're messengers of peace. And uh, the scouts and staff now have been involved, you know, helping the people in this disaster. But they're always there. I mean, the, the Boy Scouts and the Girl Scouts, they're out there working. So it's, it's great. It's a great tradition. We want everyone to know that we know what they're doing. We know how, what an effort they have made, uh, how generous they have been. And we really, really thank them and we're appreciative. And it means everything. When you have that kind of support behind you, and you know you're not alone, it really gives you the strength to go on. We are messengers of peace!